Plaza Supermarket. Chef on Las Vegas now. Wow. Wow. That's what you'll say if you've never been to a La Bonita uh, supermarket. Let me tell you, it is not your average produce section. It really is. So cool. It's amazing. <laughs> okay, Lindsay Simon, who we are thinking may be headed to the hospital, what, tomorrow? She says tomorrow. We'll she's, see. She's We're on Baby tomorrow, Watch. Baby right? Watch 2018. All right, before any of that, yes. Lindsay stopped by to check out all the fruits and vegetables, including rare fruits mm -hmm. and special herbs said to bring good luck. Mm. Take a stroll through La Bonita's produce section. You'll notice they have the staples. They've got bananas, they got apples, they got pineapple, tomato, cucumbers. But where else in town will you find jackfruit? I don't know. This is my first time even <laughs> finding out that jackfruit was a thing. But we have Celeste here that does know what it is, how you eat it, and what it does. What and the yeah. heck is this thing? Okay. Are you ready for some <laughs> mind-blowing information? Yes. Jackfruit is actually a substitution of pork and meat. So a lot of vegetarians and vegans actually cut up the fruit and it's, however you season it, it, be, it kind of adopts that flavor. So there you go. So Very mind-blowing for you. <laughs> yes. A meat substitute? Yes, it is. Well, it mm -hmm. feels like an armadillo. <laughs> I right? assume, I don't know, I've never touched an armadillo, but it's rough. And this is it cut open, and it, are these the seeds? Yes, those are the seeds, and it's actually called the fruit of the seven melons. Fruit of mm -hmm. the seven melons. Yes. Wow, very cool. And I also hear that you guys have an incredible chili selection here. An incredible, it's an understatement. I have it to is, see this. It's a great collection, so let's take you over there. Okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I have some of these in my backyard. Um, these are peppers? No, these are actually nopales, which oh. is English is cactus. Okay, nopales. Yes, nopales, which is all we also use it kind of like as a pico de gallo sauce. So as you see here, we sell it in little bags. Um, it's already chopped up for you, so we did the job for you. Um, you mix it with onions and tomatoes and make it a very good sauce. Oh, that sounds delicious and kind of easy. I feel like I could handle that. <laughs> you can definitely do that. You can definitely do the chile relleno too. So we okay. use this. Uh, chiles, which these are amazing. I mean, you can stuff it with anything in there practically, you know, and you can see the size is very comfortable. Um, but one of my favorites is the unique red jalapeno. Very this hard to find. Guy. So you can't really find this a lot of places? It's very hard to find it. No, I'm <laughs> you did not want to do that. You scare me for a moment. <laughs> All right, this is one of my favorite sections right over here. We have our fresh herbs. So anything that you're looking to make very, very homemade, mm -hmm. you got the herbs right over here. We have the fresh mint. We have the fresh uh, rosemary and oregano. Uh, chamomile is one of my favorites. This one right here is yes, chamomile? Yes, that is actually a chamomile flower. And oh, you wow. can put it in hot water and make a nice, relaxing tea. Oh, wow, instead of buying the tea packets. That's crazy. Yes, oh, it's I'm very gonna have to fresh. do that. So what else do we have? Um, and we have the root plant, which okay. is actually, they call it the luck plant. So Hispanic kids basically use this for, you know, they say, oh, you're having bad luck, go take a shower with root plant. So basically wow. you dump it in the water and there you go. This have is good luck. luck. <laughs> no. <laughs> a little hurt. <laughs> yes, I love it. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm going to have to get this. Celeste, thank you so much for having us and kind yeah. of showing us around. This produce section is humongous. I've never seen anything like it. Yeah, so this is one of our biggest products. It's actually 55 dance square feet for the whole store. That's incredible. And guys, six La Bonita locations throughout the valley. So no matter where you are, there's always a La Bonita. <laughs> yeah, those produce sections are incredible. And yeah. as Lindsay said, there are six La Bonita markets in the valley. And to find a store near you, just head to bonitamarkets.com.